Hey, I'm Brady. I'm the fabricator here at Southwest Human Development's Adapt Shop, and I was just going to show you a little project we've been working on recently. Um, if you've heard of the Power Wheels or Go Baby Go, maybe it was a project that uh, got a lot of traction, and the Ride On Toys. Um, I don't have any back here, but I can show you up front. Um, uh, Power Wheels, Wild Thing they call it. So it's got it's got two motors, uh, one on each wheel, and then you use these joysticks. You can push forward and back. Um, to drive the the unit, but um, it's very similar to a product that we've made in the past, which is this power scooter. It's early mobility device for kids with disabilities, um, and we just use switches that plug into these mono ports, uh, just like a lot of switch activated um, toys and things like that, to drive direction and um, movement. So, um, but we wanted to see if we kind of merge these two because. It's really expensive and time consuming to create this one, but if we could buy a unit like this and then just kind of put some of the parts in, then we could save some time and money, hopefully. So uh, we've been working on that, and I'll show you where we're at. So demonstration. Um, so here's the, the modified one, and this has got um, an Arduino Uno in it, as well as a Sabertooth 2x12 motor controller. And then um, that connects directly to the stock battery and the stock motors. And then we've just run the switches uh, that are labeled up through the port where the joysticks used to come out. And then that comes up to our little, little jelly bean array up here. So let me try to clip this on. Maybe better. Better if I just clip it on over here. Plug the battery in. It powers up the motor controller as well as the Arduino board. And then it's just going to be an input. Um, put this one forward. Top speed can be adjusted through the Arduino program, as well as we could put a, a little adjustable trim pot on the board as well. But um, yeah, so that's where we're at right now. It slows down significantly if I sit in it, but it would slow down also if a child was to sit in it. Um, and I've also been working, there's the stock seat. It's got this clip on the front. i been just fabbing up a quick uh, seat to go on top as well. That would just allow us to give a nice supported backrest as well as uh, contoured seating just to help with stability and um, yeah so we keep working on this and we'll keep you updated